Tempest here. Hello and welcome to Tempest Weekly. This time we're going to talk about the elder charms of good fortune. What's a good way to use them, how they work, where you get them, how you get them, and all that good stuff. So let's jump right in. First up, how do we get them? Well, by doing dailies in Mists of Pandaria, you get lesser charms of good fortune. And when you have 90 of these, you can hand them in for three elder charms of good fortune. You can only do this once per week though, and the person you hand them into is located at your main hub in Pandaria for your respective faction. So for Horde, it's at the Shrine of Two Moons, for Alliance, it's at the Shrine of Seven Stars. So first up, we want to make sure that you're getting your three Elder Charms every week as it is a weekly. But then what do we do with all these lesser charms we're getting from the massive amounts of dailies that we're doing? Well, be sure to keep every last one of them because we aren't going to want to have to do dailies every day later on in the expansion. So stockpile what you can while you do the dailies now to help prevent needless exertion later on. Alright, so now we know how to get them and where to get them. Now what the heck do we use them for? Well, these lovely coins can be used to give us an extra chance at loot. Do note that this is a chance at loot, so you might get some gold instead of your highly desired piece of epic gear. You can only use one coin per boss, so you can't stockpile them and spend them all on one boss. The coins will also only give you loot for the spec in which you defeated the boss. So if you're a main spec healer but had to go DPS for the fight, that means that using the token will give you a chance at a piece of DPS gear. So, don't use the coin unless you want gear for the spec that you defeated the boss in. So, what bosses should we use the coins for? Well, quite simply, you should use them for the bosses who drop something that you really want, but did not get from the boss itself. That way you get an extra chance at your desired item. Remember the item is from the boss's loot table, so if you use a coin on an LFR boss you have a chance at an LFR item. Use it on a normal boss and you have a chance at a normal item. Use it on a heroic boss and you get a chance at a heroic item. So if there are heroic bosses that you are killing that drop stuff you want, best to save the coins for them. But remember that these wonderful lucky coins cap at 10, so do not stockpile them for too long. Use them right and you have a better chance of getting more of the gear you want. But remember, if you don't use them at all, you're getting nothing anyway. And that's it for this Tempest Weekly. I hope you enjoyed, and perhaps that this helped you out. If you did and it did, then be sure to comment, like, and subscribe for more. You can also follow me on Twitter at twitter.com slash dgtempestfugit. There is a link in the description for you. Good luck, and have fun.